Hey everybody, this is Joby, and I am at the Golden Vendor in Cyrodiil, and she brings golden jewelry, and necklaces, and helmets, and here we go, let's look. Elegant Ring. When you use a light attack, you reduce the health, magic, or stamina cost of your next active ability cost within 2 seconds by 10%. 150,000 gold, 300,000 alliance points. King of Griffin's Reprisal, 250,000 gold or 500,000 alliance points. Let's see. When you deal critical damage, you or an ally can activate the Griffin's Reprisal on the enemy within the next 8 seconds, causing a small Griffin to fly away, to fly by and deal 22,512 bleed damage over 10 seconds to enemies within 5 meters. This effect can occur once every 20 seconds and scales off the higher of the synergy activator weapon or spell damage. Ring of Nikulus. When you block, you gain a stack of Nikulus resolve for 5 seconds, up to once every half second. After 8 stacks, you consume Nik Nikulus resolve and deflect the next direct damaging attack made against you within 5 seconds, avoiding it completely. 250,000 gold, 500,000 alliance points. Ring of the Radiant ba uh, Bastion, 150,000 gold or 300,000 alliance points. And you deal 10% of all direct damage done to you back to the attacker, up to 4,250 damage. Okay. We've got Blood Spawn, and they come in light, medium, or heavy, and infused or impenetrable. And they're 200,000 gold, or sorry, 200,000 alliance points and 100,000 gold. One item adds 124 stamina recovery. Two items, when you take damage, you have a 6% chance to generate 13 ultimate and increase your physical and spell resistance by 3601 for 5 seconds. This effect can occur once every 5 seconds. Okay. Mighty Chudan's Arm Cops. One item adds 1435 armor, two items adds 1164 maximum health, and th two items, so, uh, yeah, two items gain ma uh, major resolve at all times, increasing your physical and spell resistance by 5948. Okay, and I'm sorry about I was late today. I accidentally deleted my game, so that's that. And, uh, I'm making the video now. I'm going to Cold Harbor now, and I hope you will join me. All right, so I've landed in Cold Harbor. It's a little bit late in the day here, but here he is, Zanil Theron. All right, what you got? Idle. Dwarven Centurion Blade, detached. Okay. Dwarven Centurion Hammer detached. Too bad you can't carry that around. Dwarven Crystal Blazer Amber turned up, turned down, turned up. Dwarven Crystal Mechanism active, inactive. Dwarven Orrery Reference. Dwarven Puzzle Cube, Mage Ascendant, active. Active. Okay, it's got all the uh, constellations. Well, six of them. Well, four of them, sorry. Dwarven Schematics, technical. Dwarven Spider Legs, in inoperative. And Dwarven Urn Masks Closed Open Closed Okay, let's look again. Dwarven Centurion Blade Detached The Hammer Dwarven Crystal Brazier Amber Turned Up Turned Down Dwarven Crystal Mechanism Active. Inactive. Dwarven Ori. Reference. 
over here you come and you're in Saturn okay Dwarven Puzzle Cube Mage Ascendant active Okay, it just says active. Dwarven schematics, technical. Dwarven spider legs, inoperative. And dwarven urn mask, closed, open. Okay, well that's about it for today for uh, Cold Harbor. And if you would like to put a post in the comment section. I'd love to hear from you guys. There's a link in the description for the Discord. And also, if you're not doing anything, 8 p.m. Eastern Time, follow me on Twitch. Upper Echelon Mediocrity is the name of the channel. If you want to join my guild, send me a message on Xbox. My name is Coyote, C-H-A-O-T-E-Y. And I'll get you in as soon as time permits. And whatnot. Alright. So until that time. Let's get paid.